Welcome to another showing of The Cocktail Enthusiast with myself, The Cocktail Enthusiast. Today we're looking at a popular cocktail that I've had quite a few times at many different bars, but I've never made one for myself. We're looking at how to make sex on, sex the, beach. on the beach. Ah uh, shit, we about to turn up. Also, this video is super special because it's the first time I'm wearing shorts for the year in a video, and it's extremely comfortable. So just so you know, I'm showing a lot of skin. Wow. Now let's take a look at what you're gonna need to make this cocktail. So we're gonna be building this cocktail direct to glass. No mixing glass, no cocktail shaker. So let's go ahead and get some ice in. And as always, you know we use that Ziploc bag because we're making cocktails at home. So first we're gonna start things off with one and a half ounces of your vodka. I'll be using Tito's handmade vodka because I like handmade, it just sounds natural and healthy. And it's also made in Texas. Not that that matters. Next, we're gonna follow that up with one ounce of peach schnapps. I'll be going with Dr. McKillicuddy's peach schnapps because it's awesome. And it's also made, I mean like, this guy's name is Dr. Aloysius Percival McKillicuddy. Who doesn't want peach schnapps from a Dr. Aloysius McKillicuddy? It just goes without saying it. It, it. it speaks for itself. Next, you wanna add in two ounces of orange juice. I'll be going with Oasis because I'm on a budget and we're not fancy folks here, okay? This is a cocktail enthusiast. We're always on a budget, times are tough. Rent is high, inflation is out of control. So we're using 100% juice or so it says from Oasis. And then next you wanna layer on top of that orange juice with some cranberry juice. What the fuck is that? Two ounces. I'll be going with Allen's Cranberry Cocktail. It almost looks identical to the Oasis, different brand, but same, it's the same thought process, okay? We're saving money, we're on a budget. We ain't got time to be freshly squeezed and fancy. You leave that for when I hit like maybe 2,000 subs, but for now we're, we're, we're struggling, okay? But for today's garnish, we're gonna be using a orange wheel. Oh God, it's so good. And now, it's time for the taste rating. Oh shit. I'm extremely curious to see how my sex on the beach stacks up to the ones I've had at bars and restaurants. Will I surpass them? Will it be lackluster? I believe in my potential, so you know what? Without further ado, we're gonna give it a little stir. I kind of want to get rid of the garnish, but you know what? I'll keep it there for aesthetics purposes. Let's mix it all together, get all that chaos wrapped together. What? Wrapped together? Let's get all that chaos mixed in. All right, let's go. Here we go again. Ooh, boy. Ooh, boy. What do I like? I like all the fruit juices. I'm, I've always been a fruit juice guy. I'm from the islands. My island flair made me a, 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 what am I looking for? I, I am just a sucker for anything that has juice, whether it's mango juice, pineapple juice, orange juice, grape juice, lime juice, you name it, I'm a juice lord. That being said, it's tasty, it's tropical, it's fruity. I like the color, I like the garnish. Everything about it just explodes, right? And there's a decent amount of alcohol as well. It does have like a smooth bite to it. Almost a little too smooth because I, I, I felt myself sipping a bit too much. So I gotta, I gotta restrain myself. You know, I gotta, I gotta stay calm. This is a video that we're not out like savages at some bar. Let's look at what I possibly don't like though. Now the taste of peach schnapps may be a bit more pronounced, which is weird. It's only one ounce of peach schnapps. Let's give it another sip just to confirm. Yeah, the peach schnapps is very pronounced. Did I put too much? Hold on, give me a second. Hold on, let's see right now. The recipe that I followed said one ounce of peach, so I put enough. Interesting. Maybe that's how it always tasted, I just forgot. But there, there is a very exclaimed taste of peach schnapps in there, okay? It, it kind of overpowers the vodka to a level. Maybe Tito's just has no strength. Maybe it's because I'm using Tito's and not something like Absolute or some strong shit. But um, yeah, the peach schnapps is pronounced. Um, anything else? Not really, to be honest. It, it, it's not even a bad taste, right? It, it just kind of, it screams at you something. That's what it is. It, it just, it, it lacks balance. So maybe you can do three quarters of an ounce of Peach schnapps. Maybe this is how it should taste, actually. 
I haven't had a sex on the beach in a long time, so I, I kind of forgot what it should taste like. Anyway, this is a good cocktail. It's refreshing, perfect for the summer, good for a nice buzz, smooth vibe. It just goes down easy. But don't you take my word for it. But don't you take my word for it. You take that sip and love life. You saw how I put my finger on the straw? I was supposed to like go for the glass, but my finger landed on the top of the straw. So I was like, don't take my word for it. It's like, ah, God, come on now. Anyway, let's close up this video. So you can expect to see my next video next week as always, because I was on time this week. Come on, man. You know, I deliver these videos on time every time, except for like the last one. That was a horrible, I, I was going through some shit. But anyway, until then, sink your teeth into this one. Let me know if you like it. Let me know if you don't in the comment section below, because I can take both ends of the spectrum. And always remember, I'm not a bartender or a specialist. I'm just a cocktail enthusiast making some good ass cocktails and having a good ass time. Oh yeah, oh wow, this lock almost went into my eye. It killed the whole moment. It is what it is though. I'll see you guys next week. Let's go. I lean with it, I rock with it. Locks under my socks fitted. Tie hole with the black tip. Houston girl, heavy accent. But my whole swag is magic. High five, fantastic. Make the money stretch like elastic. Making moves that you couldn't imagine. Eating, still watching my calories. Just to pull in that big boy salary. It's just the way that it has to be. I'm a bad boy.